everyone, I'm Nandu. Last year, during Heart for the House Miracle Offering, I was trusting God to marry the man of my dreams as well as for a healthy baby. After hearing about Heart for the House, I prayed and trusted God regarding giving an offering because I knew nothing is impossible with God. His word says, Seek ye first the kingdom of God, and all these things shall be added unto you. Heart for the House 2015 was launched and I was preparing my heart to give. On the 6th of December, I gave my offering. A few weeks later, on the 26th of December, I married the man of my dreams, Sabelo. I was so overjoyed because I was going to spend the rest of my life with the man of my dreams. Shortly after we got married, I was admitted into hospital whilst I was pregnant. The doctors didn't know what was wrong with me, so they had to do blood tests which was very scary knowing that I'm pregnant. After doing the blood tests, results came back and the doctor diagnosed me with TB. I was told that I will need to go on TB treatment for six months. Being told this while I was pregnant was really the most heartbreaking news to hear. I couldn't sleep that night. I stayed up the whole night, praying and asking God to move on my behalf. The doctors also said my child will also be born with TB and will also need to take the relevant treatment once he is born. I was so shattered. When I was discharged from the hospital, the doctor gave me the TB treatment for six months. When I got home, I prayed and I said to God, this can't be true. I really got stressed and depressed. I couldn't even take the medication because of nausea from the pregnancy. I then went back to the doctor and tell him that I'm unable to take the medication. The doctor said, I have to, or else myself and my baby will die. I continued to pray. And one day, I believed very strongly in my spirit that God was leading me to throw away the medication. And so I did, but I was very scared because now I'm killing both myself and my baby. God then reminded me and said, you said you wanted marriage and I gave it to you and you asked me for a healthy baby. I could sense in my heart God was speaking to me and saying trust and believe in me. On the 7th of April 2016, I gave birth to the most handsome boy besides my husband, Dando Zuma. The doctors did blood tests and all other tests for me and my baby. The tests came back and they were all clear. There was no sign of TB. My son was healthy and we were sent home. We kept going back for checkups for my son and he is healthy. My son has never been admitted to hospital for any illness. God's word is true. When we are generous towards God, he is generous towards us. God has really been generous towards me and my family. I am looking forward towards Heart for the House Miracle Offering 2016 as we take a giant leap forward together as a church and I am excited to be part of it.